Hello and welcome everybody and thank you guys for joining me again. My name is Wilkie and I'm back with the next Battle Ride video and uh, yeah, there has been quite a big patch. I'm pretty sure you've noticed because I made um, some videos about the new champions and um, yeah, also I, I'm not sure if I'm going to talk about the patch notes because there has been quite a few things that have been patched and unfortunately I ended up in a normal game. Uh, there, there is, there's a couple things that happened last patch. Um, other than there were two champions that are released, like Jumong and Rukan, they did actually rework quite a few of the champions. Battle rights were changed, altered, nerfed, buffed. Uh, there, there was a lot going on actually in the latest patch. And also they split up the queues now, so we have a normal queue that basically doesn't have any visible matchmaking rating at least. And basically ranked is now what we played before, so where you saw your, um, I guess, division and your scoring. This is pretty much what it looked like in the past, and now this is just uh, transformed into ranked, so that was good. And bad by me. So basically now ranked is what we played before, and normal is just some, I guess, skirmishy thingies. And um, yeah, also they kind of altered it so that if you are in a queue and you don't get to find oh that was good wow dude i'm such a bad jumong Woo, god damn it so they did uh, what i'm trying to talk while well, i'm hopefully not getting wrecked pretty badly Woo, let's get away here is that that if you are waiting in the queue for too long, the game will automatically match you with uh, the other oh shoot, that was bad. The other guys. So basically, if you are being matched with somebody who's not ranked, you're gonna end up in a game like this. Because usually, I don't really care about my MMRs. So I only, uh, <laughs> I only queue ranked because I think this is the best way to learn. Even though I'm playing a champ and I, well, he's level 5 now for me, so I did play him a bit. But I don't really care if I'm gonna lose whatever, how much rating it is. Uh, I prefer ranked because there's less trolling there and people actually try to fight and win. So I prefer that over normal queues any day. But um, probably due to the new champions and the recent changes, uh, ranked queues sometimes take a couple of minutes. Even for my ranking, which doesn't make too much sense because I'm pretty sure there's a lot uh, other people with same or even high ranking. So, god damn, I'm shooting like I'm drunk. Yeah, let's get away here. Why did the orb? Take 16 damage. That was a bit weird. I heard Paloma. Oh, wow. What? Double root? What the hell? That was a super awesome ulti. I'm not sure if he realized that he set it up quite well. Probably didn't, but hey. The thing is, we're probably not gonna win, so. Should have charged longer and kill it, I guess. Yikes! No, come here! Oh man, croak. This is gonna end not very good. I should have charged the ulti longer, actually. I thought she's gonna escape. Uh, I would have probably been able to kill her. I'm not really using my battle right very well, so I probably should have picked the heal, which is uh, the reason because, like I said, I'm. I'm not the... I'm certainly not the best Jumong out there. Uh, which we're gonna... We're, 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 how much does it do? That's, that's almost a 100% buff. And then again, I don't have any heal. Alright, let's go for this one. This is usually the battle rights I take. Uh, but the first one is probably a bit iffy. Usually what the combo should be looking like, I'm not sure if I'm, if I'm able to do because we're fighting too ranged. Which is kind of annoying for Croak. Uh, and kind of hindering the setup possibilities for me. Something like this, root, shoot, and shoot again for the e-cap. This is uh, what you can do with the battle right. 
if you are so to take it. Nice. Well, that was good. That was pretty good. Uh oh, that was that was super bad. Oh, you got Paloma! Holy craps! Get her, dude! Okay, damn, he's gonna counter, pretty sure. There we go. Alright, he's dead. That was, that was pretty good. <laughs> well, there's the flame, apparently. Well, like I said, this is normal, so the, it doesn't really matter if you win or lose. Which is probably why we don't see the super best display. So this is the stage where I don't really like any of the battle rights, to be honest. I think mobility-wise he doesn't need any more movement speed. Uh, the charge on his auto uh, on his spacebar. I don't know, I use it more as a defensive tool than offense, so this is usually what I take. Alright, that's progress counter. Alright, he's gone. Oh well. I whiffed it, I whiffed it pretty badly. And there we go. In cap. Sup, Paloma? Oh wow, I'm so stupid. Why did I even use that? I don't know. Super easy for him to get, um, what? what? Did he not already use his counter? Pretty sure he's gonna use. Oh damn it! I thought it was gonna be somewhat close. All right now he's gonna get super wrecked. Jumong is actually quite annoying if you fight if you fight against him. Um, unlike like pretty much well he suffers a similar issue that Taya does, that he doesn't have any. Well Taya has at least her tornado every 15 seconds if she has the energy. But Jumong has absolutely nothing to traverse through terrain, so any walls or anything will mean he has to walk around it. So this makes him very uh, easy to space around if you have a champion that has at least a jump, which he doesn't. But he's very mobile, so he's very quick on his feet due to uh, his his uh, prowl, what it's called. That's prox counter, there you go. It's gone. And we got a mark on. But I'm not able to land a hit. Let's just land some damage then. Get some energy going. Alright, this is very good. This looks really good actually. I'm so stupid, man. Holy crap. I think he didn't realize I was gonna do that. Very good. Boom. God damn, I love that ultimate so much. We did it at the end. That was actually that was actually kinda improved because I probably stopped talking about random stuff. I probably talked gibberish the first two minutes, so <laughs> I apologize for that. Um and it's kinda late here, so the lighting's probably gonna be terrible again. Uh, but hey, as I said, this is, uh, yeah, it was definitely normal queue, so this is kind of, uh, yeah, like I said, you can switch between those, and, yeah, this is, or maybe, I, I don't know, maybe I wasn't standard because I wasn't there. I don't really know exactly. Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed some random match with, uh, Jumong. I'll try to get him to rank 10, and then I'll be working on Rukan. And, um, as I mentioned, I'm working on a Jade guide, but I was kind of hesitant to release it because they did actually rework her quite a bit. And, um, pretty much two of the key features that were her playstyle were, well, not nerfed, just changed or removed. So, Jade works quite different now, which basically means everything I collected so far is kind of useless. So, I'm not gonna release any of the intel or any of the parts of the guide unless I feel safe that they actually still apply to Jade, which parts of them will certainly not do. And uh, yeah, I'm not even sure. I personally don't like the new Jade. I do agree that the 
change of her immaterial perk that it was too strong but I would have lived with a nerf for like change it from 1 second to 0 0.5 seconds immaterial so it's literally only a spot on dodge if you time it right and not a whole 3 second where you basically can't even be touched but well yeah Anyways, hopefully, like I said, you guys enjoyed this, and uh, yeah, stay tuned for more. I'm not entirely sure. I'll, I'll probably go back to the daily series. I just wanted to do some uh, Geomonk footage and talk about the patch notes. Maybe I'll make a separate video talking about everything that has happened in the patch notes so that people are able to catch up, because some of these changes are actually quite, quite significant. So look out for that, and uh, yeah, see you guys next time.